see what he just did? Incredible! Nobody takes to the skies quite like him. starting to slow down some. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. Well, this certainly escalated in a hurry. I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly. Boom! Slam! With authority. The butterfly suplex, the end is near. Goes for it a second time. Uh, Set him up in position here. Oh, this is tornado Boom. DDT. Viking DDT. He's got him now. Putting it all on the line. Ray Mysterio looking for something big. Rollins just playing scary when he's rolling like this. And Rey Mysterio says, not this time. Incoming! And there's a vicious slam. Got the leg. Dragon screw. That'll tear your knee up. And Rey Mysterio says, not this time. Eric Rowan, no problem getting out of that one. Byron, knowing Rey Mysterio, the competitor, the way that you do, what would you say the superstar must do in order to be successful against him? Well, rule number one when taking on Rey Mysterio, in my opinion, would be to stay away from the ropes. If you know Rey Mysterio, you know that the rope is where he executes a great deal of his offense. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. As Byron mentioned, a lot of Mysterio's offense comes from utilizing the ropes. You got the West Coast pop, 619, dropping the dime. But Corey, how realistic is it to expect Mysterio's opponents to stay clear of the ropes? Well, if they want to win, it's very realistic. Just stay in the center of the ring and only veer from there when on the offensive. It's that easy. Yeah, if he hits this, the match is over. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Are you kidding me, the Dragon Runner? Game, set, match. This war is eliminated. Takes him down hard. You gotta love that kind of aggression. Daniel Bryan is one of the most difficult WWE superstars to prepare for. Corey, what would you say is the best way to counteract the leader of the Yes Movement? Look, I don't particularly like most of the... He thinks he has it! Luke Helper powers that shoulder up. It's way too early. Let's return to counteracting Bryan's fervent fan base. Byron, how can an opponent deal with Daniel Bryan? And Big move coming. Wait for it. He's a man. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Is it enough to put Harper away? Yeah, I, I don't know if Harper can recover. He will. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, from behind. That's one of the most chokers on the mat. We've got one of the best ever mat technicians in the ring right here. Guys, how can you beat Daniel Bryan? Well, as you alluded to, Mike, look at it here. But is it enough to put Harper away? I want to go back to our Daniel Bryan strategy discussion from earlier. 
Byron argued that trying to out-wrestle Daniel Bryan wouldn't work. Corey, what would you do? Well, I'm still not sure Bryan would have ever been able to counter my lucky 13 submission if we'd ever met in the ring. But anyway, the point remains that if you have a strength or speed advantage against Daniel Bryan, rely on that. Because otherwise, he'll keep you grounded permanently. Ferocious. It's like someone hit the repeat button for this move. Elbow drop. This could end it in a hurry. There he goes, crashing to the floor. He's going for the pin. One, two. Never say die attitude out of him. The Bludger Brother stays alive. Harper kicks out. Here we go. Start the count. Any more punches and Saxon's going to have to take his shoes off. Jigga Katuki. What a shot. He hits the senton. Oh boy, he is rolling. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. But is it enough to put Harper away? That one was even more impressive than the first time we saw him. Got him with the S-lock! If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Harper Let me tell you, that can cause it. some serious injury. In the midst of all this action, we have the winners. Let's take a little look at some of the action from that match. Wow. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Here are your winners, Rey Mysterio and Daniel Bryan. Nice teamwork by these two here tonight. They make it look so effortless in there. What an amazing duo. And folks, if you're just joining us, I'm sorry to tell you that you just missed one of the most exciting SmackDown matches in recent memory.